John, in terms of a pre-season run, obviously that one being the first day, how would you rate it? How do you feel? Yeah, good. Re re really pleased. We've had a, a good um, eight days away. Um, came back yesterday. Uh, we would debating whether to play a game today or not. We would sooner have played tomorrow. We couldn't get one tomorrow. Uh, but very pleased. Um, we, we passed the ball, I thought, decently. Uh, not too much organisation, but so most of the work that we've done has been, been physical and the intention was to get back now and have three weeks working with the balls, which we'll do. But I, I, I was quite pleased we made some chances, a few little errors and that. But, but yeah, really, really, really pleased. I suppose pre-season is about trying to create partnerships in a way, isn't it? You know, and obviously, kind of, of course, top yeah. first half you had uh, Oliver Hawkins, Michael Cheek. How do you think they kind of linked up? All right, Hawks look sharp. Uh, yeah. Cheek is this is his first go at full time, and I think he's probably found it really. He found the week away really tough, as the boys that come out of, sort of part-time football into full-time football uh, do. I mean, when Hawks first came, he, he, you know, he found it difficult and Faye and. So that they do for they do for a while, but they, they done all right. And uh, to be fair, when we went away, young Mason done very very well, and I thought he looked sharp today, and Morgan looked sharp. Um, you know, I, I just think that you know that there's, there's a an edge, to, there's a little edge to, to what we've been doing. Uh, but I'm always a, 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 a realist in, in expectations, and at the moment I don't have an expectation. I know it sounds silly. I just, you know, people's fitness is, is the main thing that we've got people fit. Uh, we know who we know who can pass and who can't pass. We know who can cross. We know who can score. And what it is, it's trying to link all them things together. And uh, that'll take a few games. That's the first one out of the way. Uh, we've got two games on, so everyone will play Tuesday. And I think that when we've done that, we should be a little bit sharper for the, for the Saturday against West Ham. Um, then we'll go again and on to Stevenage, and everyone should be a bit sharper again. So, you know, it's, it's all going in the right direction, and we had some decent uh, performances. Up. We kept the ball very well, we moved the ball very well at times, lost possession on occasions and looked a little bit open. Uh, but when we get to doing the, the organisation of us, you know, we'll, we'll work on that side of losing the ball, how do we get it back quicker. So, but yeah, I was pleased. We should talk there about kind of um, uh, midfield a little bit, kind of slightly there. Yeah. Jake Howells, obviously, first half in, in midfielder, uh, centre mid. Is that a position we could see more of him? Yeah, I mean, he's played uh, that from the he plays wide left, he plays left back, he played. I, thought, I actually thought he was the game's best player today, um, albeit uh, pre season friendly. But um, when he came last year, he'd stud his knee off, and we was trying probably too hard to get him fit too soon, if I'm being honest. Uh, but he's done uh, really well in pre-season. Uh, his training has been excellent, and he's, uh, I think his form today he was first class. A very clever player, and uh, it gives some good. It gives us some good choices because of his versatility. You talk about versatility there as well. See, as, as you mentioned, one of the positions he can play is left back. But I'm sure you'd love uh, an out and out left back to add to the squad. Is there any movement on there at all? We've got an out and out left back with Luke Pennell. Uh, Jake Howells must have played. I don't know, 25 games there for me at Luton. So he can play left back. Are we still looking at one or two positions? Yeah, we are still looking at one or two. Um, but they've got to be the right ones. We've done well in our recruitment. So I'm not going to rush in and, you know, if the right player can, becomes available uh, and our inquiries find us the right player, then, 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 then we'll do it. But, you know, I'm not rushing around looking for players, uh, I'm looking at players, I'm not rushing around looking at players. Yeah. And in terms of outgoing, I don't know if you saw it, but a couple of weeks ago there were rumours suggesting that Portsmouth were having a look, might have made a bid for Oliver Hawkins, he's um, something you want to keep hold of guys. Portsmouth have made four bids for Oliver Hawkins, and they've all been turned down. Thank you. <laughs>